Welcome and welcome to the present. If you're seeing my channel for the first time, please consider subscribing by hitting the subscribe button. Strike a like on the video, very, very important. And do not forget to turn on your notification bell. Extremely important too. Tomia Sutakir has signed a brand new contract at Arsenal. I'm excited. I'm sure a lot of fans are excited. Yes, some of you might be concerned about his niggle injuries here and there, but he is a quality player on the days he's available. He can play across the back foot as a left back, as a right back, as a centre half, right centre half, left centre half. Tomia Sutakir can do it all at a high level, not just doing it. And you guys are like, okay, let's see what he can do. He can play across the back four at at least 8 over 10, giving him top-class performance. According to players in the club, he is the best one-on-one -on -one defender. Like, he shows that quality. Even though he doesn't make it to be uh, in a best centre-half pairing with uh, Saliba and Gabriel, but players in the club have confirmed he is the best one-on-one -on -one defender in the club. And that's fantastic news. Fantastic news. So let's listen to some of the things uh, the manager at Edu had to say regarding Tommy also signing for the club. Sporting director Edu said, We are very excited to have Tommy with us for more years to come. He has huge quality both on and off the pitch and offers so much strength and versatility to the squad. Keynote versatility to the squad. Tommy is a top uh, professional. It's great that he will continue to play an important role uh, in the years to in the years coming, as we work together at achieving our goal, that's some fantastic uh, uh, words, uh, uh, choice of words from Edu regarding uh, Tomiyasu. Let's look at what Mikalati had to say regarding Tomiyasu. We are so pleased to have Tommy commit his future to us together with his natural ability and strength. Tommy's attitude, mentality, and values are first class. It shows the kind of person he is. Tommy is loved by everyone, has been an integral part of our squad since joining. You remember when he came in and changed our uh, defense, the, the right back situation, it took it from mediocrity to uh, merit. The way he trains with his desire and determination to be the best version of himself every day is admirable. We look forward to continue working with Tommy in future years. Tommy's new contract is subject to completion. So now we've not discussed the length of the contract, but it's a, according to our, uh, us, now they use the word a long-term contract. So we got some news regarding that from some uh, a journalist who knows his word. He says, let's post it and talk about it. Uh, Tommy, uh, Takia Tommy also his contract with us now is now official. The 25 year old has signed a deal on to 2026. Are you guys surprised? So, with an option of another year, that means technically signed two years contract with an optional additional one. You're making it a three year contract technically. I'm so happy to extend my contract because Arsenal is one of the best clubs in the world, he said. Now, some of you might be concerned that why did they sign a two plus one year? Now, I'm guessing, just my personal guess, uh, I'm guessing that it's because of the, the injury negotiation has been suffering from for the past few years we know he's a top quality defender we know he's a great guy uh, we know his education we you cannot doubt his work ethic but the niggling injuries is picking up that might be a concern but you need to still reward him for when his availability the quality he has to the team and he has to the score the fact that he can play across the back four is 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 is, is great that there are no many defenders in the world that can play across the back for at that level some, some people can play right back and give you maybe 8 over 10, but you ask them to play left back or center half, they might go to 5 or 6. But Tomiyasu can give you 8 over 10 as a right back, 8 over 10 as center half, 8 over 10 as a left back. Across the back four, he's a solid top professional. And if you didn't actually have to reward him in wages, maybe we won't have signed a new contract, but you have to reward his effort and his ability uh, in, in conversation with the rest of the squad. And we know there are a lot of other clubs are actually eyeing Tomia, so regardless of whether we're going to sign to a new contract or not, the likes of Bayern, likes of Inter Milan, the way Stephen around. And if you want to keep a top professional like that, a top quality defender like that, you need to reward them for their efforts. We know the injuries are there. In the next two to three years, if the injuries uh, subside and he's not having frequent injuries. I am sure his agent and Arsenal will sit down the table again and negotiate a, another extensive contract and they'll sign it. So I'm not really overly concerned about the length of the contract. I guess some of you are going to be panicking. Why is it two plus one? Common sense will tell us it's because of the injuries it is suffering for now. But if you can prove his fitness across the next one or two years, I'm very sure Arsenal will revisit it and reward him accordingly with more length and more money. So I'm happy 
Tomiari has signed is great news for the club. That we're actually, in my opinion, stockpiling top quality defenders uh, in the club. There's Saliba, there's Gabriel, now Tomiasu, Ben White, Timba, Kivio. Name it. There's top quality defenders in the club. Guys, let me know what you think about this uh, uh, signing of Tomiasu to a brand new contract in the comment section. What do you think? Are you excited like me? Or you're just like, hmm. You just want you just want you guys signing a new contract. Let me know in the comment section. On your way out, be kind enough one more time. Strike the like button. If you are seeing my channel for the first time, please consider subscribing if you enjoy the content and make sure you turn on your notification bell. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye for now.